What's up guys, this is Deer Boy coming in with a brand new video. Today I want to show you the Tiger 1 tank in Battlefield. Before I get into it, I would just recommend you guys, I would say buy Battlefield 5. This game is just amazing. Um, it came out in November 2018 and even now they didn't even add any extra like content updates to it yet so all they did this whole entire time is they buffed it so the game was more balanced and well put together because um uh dice feel like they released the game too early or ea or whatever you know what i mean the, the people who made battlefield 5 um they felt like they just pushed the game release too early so they didn't want to start out in dlc if the game wasn't perfected so if you buy it right now it's still 60 bucks the only thing you'll be um, missing is all the guns and stuff because a lot of people are already max rank because the rank only goes up to 50 so if you bought it on you know release then yeah but it won't take you long to get used to the guns and get better guns and stuff you'll rank up as you go and it's very fun um, but yeah here's the looks of the tiger tank um, it's the best looking tank in the world in this video I'm going to be telling you facts about the real tiger tank from real life and the one in the game of course because the one in the game is the one from real life it's just they put it in a video game and the looks of this tank is just amazing I mean look at this thing um, in the game it's equipped with a big 50 caliber like I don't know if it's 50 caliber but it's a big like LMG on, on the thing uh, MG42 from the game but I don't know what type of bullets that takes, but it's a big MG on the roof that someone can use. Also, it's a three-seater. So, also, somebody can use this gun right here if they sit in it. It's like a, just a machine gun that actually does decent damage and it kills them, plus you're in a damn tank. So, yeah, it has a nice little machine gun there that they can shoot out of from the front. And then, of course, there's you in the inside with the cannon, and you, then you also get tank rounds. Um, I think yours are like, I think my tank rounds are right there. I don't know, really know where mine come from, but yeah, I mean, if you look at this tank, look, someone else is John one, he knows how much of a monster this tank is. But yeah, that's the looks of it. It's called the Tiger One Tank. And so now let's get into it. Um, I'm not going to really focus on killing too many people because I want to tell you about the tank and whatnot. But maybe I'll get a few kills and it's hard. You need to concentrate. So this is a heavy tank. Most of the tanks in World War II are uh, medium tanks. Uh, but this thing was a nightmare to people. Sherman seen this, like the uh, Sherman tanks that the US had, they were scared. This is every tank's worst nightmare. You see a Tiger tank? There's also the Tiger II, which a lot of people might confuse the Tiger I for. The Tiger II was known as the King Tiger. That's what a lot of people in the US call it. Um, that tank is the Tiger I. But they made it the Tiger II, a whole new tank, because um, they they like buffed it, okay? And they added like, a whole bunch of more armor on it, and they basically turned uh, a, constrict, a complete monster into an invincible monster. It was very hard. Like a Tiger II could take out like five Sherman tanks on its own, pretty much. Like that's how that's how good it was. That's how you don't to concentrate. Yeah, motherfucker. Ooh, I love this tank. This is the type of tank you definitely do not just drive into the battle, because in this game at least, because the enemies can so easily, they, like they could just dynamite you, and you definitely don't want that. Um, you know what I mean? Because they could just go around the sides and the back and just blow it up. So you want to sit in a little distance, just like so. Oh, bitch. Oh, I don't know where they went. As you see, they're barely doing damage to this thing from the front. That's why you want to just sit here. But yeah, this tank was so powerful in World War II, this and the Tiger II, that, um... Hitler demanded that if by any means the thing goes down, where am I getting shot from? Okay, now I'm getting pissed off. I think I'm getting hit from the back, and that's what I don't want. I don't know where I'm getting hit from. This is why it's hard to make video. Oh, there you are. <laughs> this is why it's hard to make videos while driving because you just get so into it because it's such an amazing tank and whatnot. 
Um, and you can keep repairing it. Like, I can go outside right now. If the game wasn't already, like, pretty much over, I'd go outside and mess with it more. But, but yeah, this tank, Hitler demanded that if any of them, like, if you had to abandon them because of any way, if it broke down, if the tracks got blown off, whatever, Hitler said that he wants you to actually blow the tank up yourself because he doesn't want enemies getting their hands on it. So that's how you know this thing was a good tank. I mean, that is exactly how the hell you know. When you have your commander saying, hey, if this tank does get like destroyed, or you know what I mean, if this tank does like get, get messed up, we need you to destroy it. Like, that's how you know shit is badass. I don't know, I'm just, I'm enjoying this tank so much. I have so much fun in this tank. Like, I just do, I really do. I have a whole lot of fun in it. Like, this tank right here is like, my favorite. Like, as long as you're smart with it, you won't get it blown up. Dude, I'm, I'm wasting ammo right now because the match is about to be over. Hopefully another tank doesn't come up here and I'm like, oh, well, I can't do anything because I'm out of tank shells. <laughs> Dude, what the fuck? Yep, there that goes. Time to get on the big gun. Yeah, but this is the Tiger too. Hitler demanded that if by any means it gets destroyed, just, or you know what I mean, messed up, just destroy it. Like I said, this, I don't know if the Tiger 1 could, I mean the Tiger 1 definitely ran tracks and circles around the, uh, or the enemy tanks, but, alright, I still got four tank shells left, but yeah, as far as like, the Tiger 2, it's like even better, but, it is just an amazing tank, and I can't wait to show you the skins, or you know, like the little liveries or whatever, not liveries, like the paint for it, I want to show you that now. This tank, man, I just love it. You could read up about it, if you go on like Wikipedia or just watch a YouTube video on the Tiger tank, you will see. There's only one running Tiger 1 tank in existence, and only one running Tiger 2 tank in existence. So, that tells you a lot. Because that's what happened. First of all, the Tiger 1 tank, I believe only 1,200 of them were made, or 1,300. And, and there's only like 8 in the world, or some shit, of Tiger 1s. And only 1's running. And they're all in museums and shit, of course. But, I mean, that's how many. They all... And it's not because they were shitty. It's because limited amounts were made. And mostly, every single crew did what Hitler said and blew him up if the track blew or if the transmission broke now you know what I mean like that's the thing this but it was uh, it was amazing um a lot of people don't like give it the respect it deserves it was ahead of its time um I love the name I love the tank the whole thing about it um the, the tank itself it is just amazing oh my I can't, I can't even tell you how much of this video I like it. As you see, I was wrecking shop on people. I wish I could have gotten a tank battle in that game and just, I would have smoked them. I beat tanks all the time. Tanks in this game get the first hit on me, and I laugh, because, because the Tiger is just amazing. The Tiger is awesome. I say, oh yeah, you want to shoot at me, buddy? And then, boom, I just light them up. So that's all I want to do. I just wanted to show you the Tiger tank this game and, you know, show you how good it is and whatnot. But this be your boy, signing out. I will catch you guys. Um, if you have any comments about the Tiger, just go in the comments and talk to me about it. Like I said, though, this is a complete monster. Um, I, I, I love this tank so much. It's my favorite tank in the world. I like it more than the M1 Abrams and everything. This tank is the shit. Best tank of World War II. Now, the Tiger II is better than the Tiger One. I believe they're probably not going to put that in the game because that would even be more overpowered. So I can see why they don't want to. But yeah, the Tiger 2, man, wow. But the Tiger 1 even, dude, I love it. Favorite Tiger 1 and Tiger 2 are the same look, just the Tiger 2 is 
the Tiger 2 was, and this is really a bad example, but like, Bugatti had the Veyron, and then they came out with the, um, the Chiron because the, they wanted a better Veyron, which, that doesn't, that's kind of a weird, that's not even it because they're the same tank just with buffs. So I don't really know what to compare it to. It's, it's it's just upgraded. That's the only difference. It's you know what I mean. It's just upgraded. Um, you know what I mean. So so yeah, that's it. But because the, the Shyron is a different car from the Bayron, so yeah, <laughs> can't really uh, can't really say anything. But yeah, I mean this Beard Boy signing out. This is the best tank ever in the world, in my opinion. It's my favorite tank ever. And so yeah, this Beard Boy signing out. Peace.